Good day friends, Maloa here and today I'm going to show you how to set up Prime. It's a plugin for Lord of the Rings Online and this is specifically for the Hidden Horde raid. Let's go! You want to start by heading over to Google and typing in Lotro Plugin Compendium. This will take you to an interface, Lotro interface page. Click on that. Um, make sure that it's the Lotro plugin compendium. There is another Lotro compendium, but it's not the same thing. What you want to do next then is hit the download button. It will download the plugin compendium zip. Open that up and you will see that there's a setup exe here. You would double click on that and then just follow through um, this plugin setup. All right, I'm not going to do that because I already have it installed. When you open it up, though, you will see this window here, Lotro Plugin Compendium. And here you can see here's the list of all of the plugins that I have added. Next, what you want to do is go over to Add New Plugins, and you'll want to search for Plime Plugin. I already have it in there, so it's not showing here but you would select it and then you would click add. After you've clicked add, you will see here that Prime plugin has been loaded. Now, the next thing you wanna do is um, from time to time, this stuff will be updated. The easiest thing to do to update all of your plugins is just click up there, click update. It'll quickly update everything for you and you're done. Now, when you log into Lotro to get access to your plugins, you want to go up to Systems and then Plugin Manager, and you will see all of your plugins listed here. Scroll down to where you find Prime Plugin, and then click the Load button. The first time you load it, there will be a pop-up window with a bunch of questions for you to go through. Just click Next and accept all the defaults. Then you will have this icon here, which is your Prime plugin. If you click on that and you type in Options, it'll bring in the Options page. You can also go back to your Plugin Manager, go to Plugin, go to Options, and open Options Panel. All right, now that you've got this open, we need to load in the Hidden Horde code into this. To find that, you're going to go to the Discord page for Prime. I will be putting the link to this Discord page in the description below for you to click on. And then what you're going to look for is you are going to look for this Hidden Horde um, under Prime U UI Examples, Hidden Horde. If you click here on this one, you will see a flashing blue light on this one. That means this is the latest one that's been updated. Download that file. Okay, you will see that it's a message.txt file. Then I want you to copy that file and place it in a location that um, works for you. I typically like to put everything in my Lord of the Rings online folder, which is in my C drive, under users, owner, documents, Lord of the Rings Online, and then I do have a plugins folder, so I would just drop that text message in here. Next, you're going to want to open up that message, and you'll see a lot of code um, that may have absolutely no meaning to you, but believe me, <laughs> this is what you need. Then you're going to highlight it all by pressing Control A, then you're going to hit Control C to copy it, you're going to go back into Lotro, and then you're going to click on this Prime UI tab down here. Head on up to this button, Import Prime UI. If you click on it, you'll see that the cursor will start um, flashing there. Hit Control V to paste all of that code into this setting. It might take a minute or two to load. Once it has completed loading, click the import button 
and you will then see this UI here called Hidden Hoard UI. If you want to move things around, click here on the Move Prime UI. So for example, there's the circle timer, um, this buff bar I want to move down because that is showing me exactly um, what is I'm doing wrong that I need to move. Um, you have timer groups, you have alerts and alert groups, and as you go through the instances, you'll see what each of these mean. Okay, um, if you're a tank or if you're a healer, right, if you go back up to here to Hidden Horde, you'll see that there's a special additional UI for tank and healers. If you click on that, you'll once again, you'll see these two messages flash. Um, you got to pick one and go ahead and install it. And that will then set that up for you. You can also customize and do some things on your own. But that's beyond the scope of today's video. I just wanted to really quickly um, get you guys set up on this. The Rolo, who is the coder and creator of Prime, he will be doing a special training session on his Twitch channel um, this coming Thursday, 2nd of June, uh, 2022 at 2 p.m. Um, he's going to go stream live and he will be showcasing the full Prime UI and all of the different settings and things that you can play around with. Um, I hope to watch it and I'll bring you guys a recap for how I'm setting up things for my, um, my, my game. All right, that's it. Have a good day. Bye. If you enjoyed today's video, please hit the like and subscribe button. For more amazing training and one-on-one -on -one coaching, please click the link to the Lojo Endgame Challenge in the description below. This is a special two-day training event where I help players plan out their exact strategy for reaching their goals in endgame rating. Whether you've just Valorant a tune or are returning to the game after some time, this challenge will show you exactly what you need to do to gear up quickly. Find a great raiding group and have loads of fun racing through endgame content. Thanks for watching.